Sam Corkborn here and Dan Gregory and hey. we just really wanted to take just a couple of minutes of your time first of all just to say thank you so much for attending the Great Expectations Showcase last week but also just give you some tools so you can build upon the building blocks of success throughout the rest of 2012. So Sam, what are your three takeaways, your three, three building blocks for success in 2012? So my three building blocks this year is I think this whole thing around bouncing forward and not bouncing back. And uh, I did cover a lot of this and I suppose it's all about you know not only bouncing back, when we do have those tough times, when we have got those frustrations and that anxiety and those crises that happen, don't look at bouncing back to where we've already been, but bouncing forward into what we can become. So suddenly we have to start thinking innovative we have to start thinking creatively because we've never been there before so bounce forward and not back Excellent. second thing is this whole thing around it is our decision not our condition that determines who we are and I suppose we all have these conditions on our life you know our mind is a lot more physical but whether or not they're financial or relationships or problems or issues we need to realize that it is our decision not our condition so it's that whole thing around attitudes and the third thing is is this whole thing around holding hands in traffic and y y you know when we when we do have those tough times and all that we need to stick together that's why collaboration and communication are, I suppose are so important in these tough times when you know we do need to allow those open lines of communication that collaboration and hold hands and go through those tough times together so they're my three things so Dan can, can I ask you the same question what are your three things to build upon 2012 yeah sure well I think what I talked about at the showcase was this idea of, of identity and this idea of building an identity with impact because identity is the thing that really drives every decision a human being makes. It's what makes us buy, it's what makes us buy in, it what's, it's what makes us work together as a collaborative team. And I think there's three things that make an identity really powerful. There's a, creating an identity that's pass onable, that's wearable and shareable, that, that people can use to represent who they think they are and actually use you know, the identity of the organisation or the movement or, or, or the point that you're trying to make to actually help them reflect who they want to be. I think building an identity that's based on understanding both of who you are and who they are is incredibly important. Understanding what really matters to them, what's important to them, you know, what, and aligning what's important with their life with what's important with your life. Because collaboration is really about alignment. Selling is about creating an aligned identity. Building a team and leading is about creating an identity that the group can share that's bigger and more powerful than the individual's identity themselves. And I think that's the last thing, is building an identity that's inspiring, an identity that's part of something bigger than just your need to sell a product, or your need to convince someone of your point of view, or your need just to be heard. Building something bigger, having people buy into an identity that's part of, of something that makes a greater contribution is actually probably the best way to create impact, because you're really creating value for other people while you're creating value for yourself. That is fantastic and we're going to finish off this video with me playing the guitar and us doing a duet or something together but I don't. We listened to the rehearsal and let's face it, it just wasn't a good idea. <laughs> Guys, again, thank you so much for attending the Great Expectations Showcase. Uh, please get in contact with Mark Booth and the team there at Great Expectations and we would love to connect with you sometime this year, 2012 or even next year. Thanks so much and have a great year. Cheers.